Welcome back to a brand new coffee tech break with Jan in your place to be for the latest and greatest on the poly products, tips and tricks, unboxing and everything you can think of around the poly products. Hopefully you enjoyed my last videos uh, where I did quite some updates on the larger rooms uh, transferring for example from USB to CAT and did an update on the Teams room portfolio. Similar, I will do soon for Zoom rooms and for any other video providers. Now, today, I think I got another great video and that's actually a sneak preview of the upcoming Teams app running on Studio X30, X50 and the G7500. So G7500 is still in that certification process. Eh? But if you install the 3.8 and you're able to test that eh, for, your, uh, for your meeting rooms. Now, today I actually want to show you that brand new upcoming version because it got some exciting new features. Well, uh, one of them is the HDMI ingest. And eh? so I have here actually a, a laptop today and I have here that brand new version running on this X30 right here. And I want to show you that experience. So how does it look like when I walk into the room with my laptop, I hook up that, uh, that HDMI cable and the opportunity to share my screen. Now, the other uh, use case which I want to show you is the BYOD mode. So I walk into this room, I got Zoom, for example, on my laptop or any other video provider. And I want to have the ability to reuse camera, speaker and mic eh, in Studio X or G7500. And I want to reuse all that equipment in combination with my laptop. I think two great new use cases eh, for the upcoming release. Now, first off, eh, let me show you with my laptop. So I have here the HDMI cable. As you can see, this is the HDMI cable which goes to that X30 here, connected here on the screen in combination with the TCA, which I have right here. That is the, uh, the HDMI cable. The other cable I have uh, is that USB cable. Now, that USB cable, let me show you that here. The USB cable is going to that USB-C right here. So you need to be able to use this for your camera, speaker and mic and to use that on your laptop. And in the other side, you see right here, this is the input for the, uh, the HDMI cable. Eh? So that's very important. We use this one. Let me show you that. So I got here my laptop and very straightforward. I walk into that meeting room. I have here my HDMI cable and I want to start sharing. And this is, I think, a use case which our customers want to be able to use. So I connect it now here to my laptop. And what you will see, very straightforward, sharing now my screen from the laptop on the big screen. Nothing special and just very easy. You just hook it in. Now, this is locally and just in room, walk into the room and share. In case you are in a Teams meeting, of course, this will also be shared in the Teams meeting very easily. And so this opens up two new use cases I think with the HDMI ingest. Now, if you don't want to share yet, you have the ability here on the TCA to stop sharing. As you see here, there is a button at the top. And if I click on that, I can stop sharing now. So the sharing is now stopped. I have still my HDMI cable is still connected, but I stopped sharing. As you can see, that button here on the top right is that share button so again if i click that share button what you will see is i'm sharing now again so very straightforward but i know it is a use case which a lot of customers uh, uh, will appreciate with the x30 x50 uh, and the g7500 now as soon as you unplug it of course uh, the system will go back and uh, show the calendar on the screen that is the first use case which I wanted to show you. Now, the second use case, which I think is also a very nice one, is you walk into this meeting room and I have a Zoom meeting, for example. 
So I want to have the ability to use camera, speaker and mic in combination with my laptop. I think a very, very nice use case. So I got here again, my laptop. And so I'm walking to that meeting room. What you will do is pretty straightforward. I put in my USB cable here in my laptop. And what you will see is the system will automatically jump now into the device mode. So you got here your mute, and let me show you that here. So you got your mute right here. You got your volume control. You got your exit button uh, to move out of the device mode. So I think really, really nice. And now you have the ability, as soon as you got that USB connected, and let me show you that, you have the ability to go here now to settings on the laptop. And if you then go to video, uh, what you will see is you see now X30 video right there. As you can see, so it's detected as a video device. And also if I now select my audio device right here, again, what you will see is X30 is now here speaker and X30 is now mic. And you actually see the audio coming in here on the X30 to, uh, to be able to use that. Really nice. So I can uh, use now all those peripherals in my Zoom client on my laptop. The next step is when I unplug. So you have that configurable timer now in the web UI of the X30 X50, uh, where you can say as soon as I unplug it, I want to switch back to Teams. So you can do that directly, uh, immediately, or you can set a preferred timer. So if I now unplug it, what you will see is the system in this case will transfer uh, immediately back into the Teams app very easily. So it opens up two use cases and the HDMI ingest and it opens up the use case for the BYOD mode using the USB cable. Hopefully you enjoyed it. I'm already looking forward to, uh, to the next video. Uh, and uh, I would say if you like this type of video, uh, subscribe uh, to my channel and I will keep you updated on any and new features, products or updates coming out.